What's going on everybody? My name is Chris and welcome back to another exciting episode of Unoriginal Craft! I literally just logged on now, so... <laughs> um, I, I always feel like, first thing when I log on, I always want to check it on spawn and see if anything's different. Um, I have yet to come by... Oh, someone else bought a stack of bones from Judah though. There was only one diamond here last time I checked. I am buying some from him eventually, I just haven't done it yet. Ooh. Oh, I thought I saw a secret chest under there. It's like, ooh, is that where he keeps all his loots? This is also the first episode I've ever recorded where I, um... It's in full screen, and I never play Minecraft in full screen. I don't really know why. Um, uh, someone in the Skype chat group, I don't I think it might have been Prono. Have I talked about Prono yet? We have a new member on the server, guys! His name is Prono. In-game, uh, Javos on his YouTube channel, check him out. I, I feel like I already did this last episode. Um, I think I added... After last episode, though. Yeah, but... I, oh, there's someone here. Oh, it was just the mailman. <laughs> um, off screen, I actually brought this villager here. And whenever I see him jump up there, I'm always terrified. I'm like, oh, he could totally jump out. But no, you can't actually go through that gap. That gap, though. Um, we're going to decorate the general store today. As you see, I don't have a roof on yet. I'm still thinking about what to put on here. Um, Kenny actually dropped by and she messaged me. She's like, why the heck do I have signs here? And I don't really know how to explain it. So I'm going to try and explain it right now. I kind of feel like, I don't know, it's like a, a kind of, does it give a kind of an older feel to the store? <laughs> no. I want to do kind of like, pl uh, not planks, but um, like boarded up windows kind of thing. I forgot to grab glass too. I'm so stupid. I don't have glass, do I? No, I don't. Crap. But yeah, today I'm going to be decorating the general store and hopefully finishing up and opening it. I don't think zombies can get through there, can they? I hope not. Um, hmm. Put a flower there. And then we'll put you down there. I just see my entire inventory is filled with a whole bunch of crap. Uh, it's not crap, first of all. Sheesh. What it actually is, is stuff I want to decorate the store with. And I don't really know what I want to do. Because I want to make sure no zombies can get to this villager. He's kind of like a sales clerk, I guess. <laughs> But the thing is, things could, like, a baby zombie could easily jump over this chest, but I don't know how to stop him from doing that. So if anyone has any idea of what I could place here as, like, a decoration, something that doesn't look stupid. I know carpet used to work, like, zombies used to, baby zombies used to, like, see carpet and recognize that as, like, a full block or something and think they can't jump over it, but they can now. I'm pretty sure that's been fixed. Um, another thing, actually, it might even be in there. I think it is in here. Is I started writing the instruction manual... It's not in here. Where the heck is it? Well, crap. Is it just gone now? It might just be gone now. What? I started writing a book to explain how the general store works. I got like six pages and all of a sudden like, the server just stopped. The server like went down. I was like, oh, crap. And then when I logged back in, like all but one page was gone. So I was like, ah, oh, and I, I really didn't feel like rewriting it so I was just like well screw this <laughs> uh, so what is this that's a painting I want an item frame did I put the item frames in here I did all right so put the cactuses in there the cacti and we're gonna give you no I don't want it there we go and we're gonna place a map in there oh can we just place a map on the wall do we not even need an item frame I might just waste an item frame really that's actually the map at my house. Crap, I should have used the other map. Uh... Oh, yes, I got it back. <laughs> Can I get the other thing back, though? I don't really know, actually. This kind of sucks. Hmm. We need to drop the dirt. Get the... Oh, he's totally gonna come out. Oh, no. Okay, you need dirt? You know what? I'm just gonna place that in this chest right here. I'm gonna look at them. Maybe we should play something else in there. Let's play that. Let's keep the dirt in the bar just in case. Do you guys know who Justin Case is? He's related to Justin Bieber. I mean, everyone who- Oh, no! Crap! Wait a minute. He can't get out, though, because I'm blocking his way. There we go. Yay! You failed your task of escaping. Do I need an item from the place a map up? What map is this? That's a spot map. Okay, great. Okay, great. We would place you... Oh, maybe we do need an item frame. We probably do need an item frame, don't we? Hmm. Okay, well, never mind. That was a waste of time then. Place the item frame right there. Place the map right... Is that the right map? 
Nope, it's not. Okay, well, I'm glad I didn't waste my time again. There we go. Place the map is spawn. And then I wanna make this I wanna make the store look as busy as possible. Um The main reason being wait, where's my item frames? What? Where the heck did my item frames go? Am I oh I did bring glass! Great! That's great, but where's my item frames? I know it's here. I had one more, didn't I? Did I place that in here? Oh, I'm stupid. Good lord. You know what? Okay, let's place the glass first. First and foremost. I'm not gonna use stained glass because that's too new school, right? It's like, who's ever heard of a general store where there's um, stained glass? I'm just thinking though, should I place the blocks or should I use the other things? You know what I'm saying? Uh, Alright, we gotta be careful here. This chest right here is not staying here. Oh no. Oh, there we go. Okay, that's easy. <laughs> Uh, Put those down there. I'm actually just coming from... Okay. <laughs> I'm actually just coming from recording a whole bunch of Super Mario World Blind. I recorded like five episodes of that. So, uh, excuse my voice if it's a bit raspy. You know what? I do like that better. But, what happens when I place a sign on it? Hmm. It doesn't go against it, which is kind of the point, actually. But if I place it on here... I might have to go with this, solely because it'll... I want kind of like a... A run-down kind of feel, right? But that looks kind of silly against windows. Hmm. I might have to think about that. I think I like this better, though. But, I mean, like, placing a sign on the, even these windows seems kind of silly. Because, like, general stores, for the most part, they're always, like, run down, and they're always, like, broken down. But it's like, no one really cares to fix them because they're freaking general stores, and no one cares about them! You know, people should care about them. Because my general store is gonna be better than that! I also gotta move this mountain back still a bit. I've been trying to figure out, like... I haven't been on the server very much lately, just because I don't haven't really had much to do. I guess, because everything I want to do, I, I kind of want to record. Hmm. Um, where are the item frames? We have a whole bunch of paintings. There's the item frames. Hmm. It's like you just can't stop saying what the, what the villagers are saying. It's so catchy. It's like a, it's like one of those new songs on the radios. You just have to sing. Uh, what am I looking for? What am I looking for? I'm looking. Oh, the compass. There we go. We already have compass. Compass go in. Can I pick stick up there. I pick stick up. Compass go in there. There we go. Crap. We should have put a clock too. Well, too late. They make clocks? That is one thing I forgot to make. Poopiolis. Um, I was gonna also name the villager. <gasps> Wait a minute. I need an anvil. Dang it. But, that's actually okay. You know what? This is so, like, unorganized and crazy. I don't know what to say and what to talk about. <laughs> uh, huh? Oh, I don't really like that. Hmm. Hmm, this could be like the hay corner. Hey, corner! You know what? Let's do that. Something like that, I guess. That's okay. Uh, scratch nose break! Oh, there we go. Okay, we have another... Let's, let's throw some paintings up. So this is definitely the episode I should probably explain. With the general... How exactly the general store works. No I was going to do that, that's why I was writing the book off camera, because I was going to come back and I was going to be like, Okay guys, I've finished writing the book, now I can tell you what it is. Um, but of course, now that that's failed. There we go, that's why I wanted something like that. Um, I can't really do that, I guess. Hmm. General stores, though, I noticed they look very busy, the walls are covered in crap, so that's what I'm trying to go for here. Cover the walls and as much crap as, like, humanly possible will fit. First off, paintings kind of randomly spread out. Then a whole bunch... Oh, I don't really like that, actually. I don't like it going to the roof, which I haven't put on yet. There we go. I do want to put, like, swords and stuff up here, too, but I don't... I don't... I'll probably come back and add those later. Sure. No, we kind of have to use the same paintings right beside each other. That's redonkin... Whoa, where's this painting going? It's painting crazy! It's all over the place! 
Nope. Um, where'd it go this time? I keep getting stuck on things. Painting! Painting! There we go, I know where you were. No, not the, not the third one. There we go. Sure, that's okay. <laughs> we only have one on this wall. Oh, no, we have a few on that wall. Um, hmm. What else should we do here? I also brought some of these. Hmm. Hello! Right now, no one else was on the server, so I'm glad Mr. Green Hippo came on. Because now we can have fun with friends! I'm going to do, like, wagon wheels. No real reason other than, once again, just kind of because. I'm going to make the outside and the inside as busy as possible. Yeah, something like that. We're going to play some crap here as well. Like, I've got a place like... I have, that's why I brought a whole bunch of crap. I literally... Here, I'm going to tell you guys what I wrote down on my list here. I was brainstorming. I even went into, like, um, on my um, single-player single, single player cheating worlds. <laughs> and I wrote down a whole bunch of things. I wrote down trapdoors, levers, buttons, pots, maps, and frames, paintings, hay bales. My H looks weird, so it looks like a hat instead of hay. Crafting tables, anvils, ladders, torch fences, and signs. To all put up on these walls. And also... I didn't put trap hooks, which is like tra tra trap wire hooks. But really, those are like one of, the, one of the first things I thought of. I don't know why I didn't put that up. I need a lot more, though. Like, those just look like little hooks, don't they? I only have two on me. I'm going to have to make more. Um, stone. I'll make 12. Why not? Why not? Like, seriously. Almost like every general... Normally, it's actually on the... In our outside, not really so much on the inside, but I don't really know what else I would kind of put on the outside. Should we just, yeah, you know what? I don't like that. I'm trying to keep this not, you know, organized. Like, I kind of just want it to be crazy and not be organized, like, at all, and just kind of have stuff all over the walls. I am going to change the torches. I was originally going to use glowstone, but I'm like, well, that's not really old fashioned looking. Of course, I don't have my fences on me. That would be just too smart. If the light levels aren't good on the floor, I might have to install some glowstone. Like, for example, if I break that torch and it gets too dark. Oh, I don't like that. I might have to do... Place the torch up here. Can I even do that? Eh. Eh. Hmm. Hmm. Exactly. Exactly, Mr. Villager. You know exactly what I'm talking about. There we go. So, let's break these. Alright, that was right beside. So, I should also place this one right beside this column. Um, get rid of our food. I know some of people do Minecraft episodes. They always get rid of, like, one of three things on their bars. But they don't get rid of, like, I could have easily gotten rid of the buttons. But no, I got rid of my food. Hi! This is the time everyone normally gets on the server, actually. Um... Hmm. So yes, I should ex I should probably explain to you guys how the general store is gonna work. So the top chests are actually used for when people are buying things, and what what the oh Judah's in my store here. What they would do is they would I'm not gonna if Judah talks to me I am not talking back to him. I am tired of <laughs> talking on my episodes, and it's really just I'm not gonna even read the chats. Okay, for example, um. Let's say, let's talk about Judas' chest. Oh, this is my, this is my book I was writing. Oh, it saved three pages. Anyways, I just, I need, I think I probably need to write this anyways. Let's write what I put so far. Um, how to use general store. How to use a store. General store is used for selling and buying miscellaneous items you're looking for or want to sell. Got to pick or sort you don't want, but think someone else might. The store is for you. Selling stacks or block of items. Is allowed, but the store is more aimed for selling things that are not in bulk. The top chests are used for what you are buying, and the bottom chests are used what are used for selling unwanted items. And I'm always scared to press sign back in. I definitely don't want to press sign. So, for example, Judas' chest would be right here, and he would always have this book in here. And if you wanted to buy something from people, he would come over here and he would click this, and then he would write. Well, first off, this wouldn't be. I, we should use a different book actually, just so that doesn't get too confusing. Um, he would place, holy crap, oh no, these guys break, oh no, this is terrible news, you need to get out of here, stupid zombies, <laughs> okay, so he would come over here, he would get his book, and then, no, actually, that's wrong, that is actually wrong, what I'm actually gonna do, 
crap. Ah, I forgot the zombies break doors. I thought that was actually changed. Um, the buying book's actually gonna be in this chest, along with the how-to book. So you come over here, you get the buying book, and then you would find your page. Good God, everyone get out of here! Jeez, Lord, I'm trying to record an episode here! <laughs> and he would come to the buying book, and for example, he would scroll through the pages until he finds the word, his name, Judah Zombie Freak. And then he would like, break down what he wants to buy. Diamond, sword, sharpness, 100,000! And then beside it, he'd be like, buying for like 10 diamonds, for example. And then he'd place done, and then he would place the book back in the chest, and then he would come back to his chest, and he would place 10 diamonds in the top chest. Okay, are you following me so far? So let me, let me talk about that one, let me like, refute that one more time. You get the buying book from here, you open the buying book, you find your page in the buying book, you write down what you're buying and the price for why you're buying it for, and then you come to your chest and you'd place that many diamonds, or not even necessarily diamonds, or it could be like iron ore or anything really, inside that chest, and then whoever felt like selling the item would come over here and they would take your 10 diamonds and they'd place that sword in the chest, should they get that. For selling, <laughs> there's gonna be, um, Let's grab another, let's actually grab another book just so we don't also confuse that. For selling, there's gonna be books in people's chests. So for example, if you're buying like you know what we should even we should or if you're selling like um let's say diamond pick fortune one hundred billion selling for ten you know, let's make it nine diamonds just so I, people don't get like you don't you guys don't get confused or something. You come you would come in here, you'd be like, hmm, what are people buying? And then you'd come in here, and you'd take Judah's book, and then you'd be like, oh, he's buying a diamond pick fortune 1,000! 100,000, actually, and he's selling it for nine di- I mean, he's- And he's selling it for nine diamonds! <laughs> I suck at explaining things. And then, like, you- the, Of course, the diamond pick fortune 100,000 would be, like, in one of these slots. And then the person, if they felt like buying it, they would- Take the they take the pick out of the chest, place it in their inventory, and then they place the nine diamonds to replace it. Of course, if they wanted to sell nine diamonds, they could do that. Like instead of saying diamond pick fortune one hundred thousand, they could put um, selling nine diamonds, selling for thirty iron or something like that. And that's all they would need to do. I'm about to punch him in the face. <laughs> oh, I broke something! <laughs> uh, so, that's how the general store is working in a nutshell. Um, I just spent like 10 minutes explaining that. Holy crap. So, we're going to place those books back in here. <laughs> we're now going to grab ladders. I feel like ladders could be used to like, you know... As wall decorations as well, couldn't they? Even though they're, they're like, Aww. people are gonna see us as wall decorations. They're like, oh, why the heck are there ladders here? I don't understand. Me neither, guys. It's okay. Don't worry. People are gonna want to climb. They go, oh, it's like a parkour map now. <laughs> uh, what are you doing? Can I place that there? Is there a button there? I can't place it there. Crap. Aww. Well, whatever. I'll wait for them to move, then I'll place something else there. Um. Well, because I'm out of ladders. I need to break these torches. Um, these walls aren't nearly filled enough. We should actually make sure our block light 10, 9, 8. So far, it looks okay. Oh, we need to break that, though. Blo uh, block light 7, yeah, things are too dark here. I'm going to need to place like a glowstone in the middle of that place here or something. Hmm. What about here? Oh. I hear damn. Oh, see, there's, there's, got a place, a thing here as well. Although, we will be playing. We need more fence eyes. Well, fence eyes. Can we have fence eyes? Do we? Wait. I thought I had like a stack of fences. What happened to my stack of fences? It's right here. Of course, I'm being stupid. All right. So I'll place that there. Go up a bit. Place the torch there. <laughs> oh, what? Did you place? Oh, because the button. That's why. That would explain. Oh my god! Judah! 
It's not your fault, but I want to scream at somebody! <laughs> uh, there we go. Now I can break these down. And you can go over here. And now this is in the way. We're going to place it there. We're going to go up here. Place that there. Without murdering people. And then... We need to make a Death Games game. I don't, I don't know why like, I felt the need to bring that up right now. Oh my good lord. Get out of here with your penis. It doesn't look like a penis actually. It looks like a Tetris piece. <laughs> uh, um, can I play stuff on here? I can't. That's kind of a pity, but oh well. What a pet, eh? Oh, uh, uh, hilarious. Haha, <laughs> your favorite item. I get it. Because it's a penis. Make fun of my gayness all you want. I'm not actually gay. <laughs> I felt like I need to elaborate that on that right now before I start rumors. Um, I am dating a woman and I have nothing against gays, but I am not one of your people. Is that right? How do you make these again? I don't remember. So like this. Hmm. I'm just reading. <laughs> he just knows. He knows he's reading my video. Um, you do, that actually makes sense, because the thick part of the anvil's up there, so that makes sense out of the blocks. Hmm. I'll place that in the corner here. I don't intend people to use these, but I guess they can use them if they really want to. Uh, we'll make another one. I have so much iron, like, I don't even care that, like, this is... Oh, I was like, what? Why did that make it? Because I'm stoop. That's why. Hmm. I should probably just make a whole bunch while I'm here, but, you know, whatever. Whatever. We'll place it right here. Ah, whatever, that's good enough. Well, I feel that's too against the wall, you know. Like, it should be placed that way. Yay! I want, I want to get, like, an anvil kill on the server. I remember Ethel always used to try and do that. He'd always, like, when people were, like, building, he would pillar above them, and they'd, he'd try to drop a pillar on their face. <laughs> I should do that. It'd be fun. E. It'd be fun to E. Let's grab iron bars. I mean, those... Eh. Eh. I don't know if I really like that or not. I can't even place one there, can I? Crappiolis. Hmm. I just really want to get this wall, like, decorated. A whole bunch of random crap. I feel like I should grab more, like, paintings or something. Or item frames. I should definitely have more item frames than anything else, really, shouldn't I? What else do we have here? We have more flower pots. I was like, why is it raining in here? But then I realized, oh yeah, I don't have a single, I don't have a single freaking roof. That's all I really need is a single roof. I don't know why anyone would ever need any more than a single roof. <laughs> uh, I did tell Judah I was recording, but I didn't know if he realized I was... Um... Ah, oh, crap, I read, I read the chat and it distracted me. But I realized he realized I'd be, I'd be buying, I'd be recording right now, I guess. Uh, I guess right here. Meh. Um, should we place one right here? Wait, oh, we have just enough, too. Great. Super. Yay! I'm going for a really weird decorating style for this place. Do you guys see kind of what I'm doing? I do notice, like I said, general stores, they do have, like, a whole bunch of crap written all over the walls. Uh, where are my item frames? Did I use them already? Did I not just do this? I literally just did this and I oh, oh, we do that. Name tag. Let's do this right now. Oh, name tag. We're gonna name our villager. Philip. I don't know why, but his name's gonna be Philip. Come here, Philip. Can I reach you from here? Yeah. Huh? Huh? Why do you make that noise? Can, why can I name you? I can name villagers, can I not? What? I can't name villagers? Nah, -uh, I refuse. That is not true. This is Blunky. This is Spelunky. Fill up. Why can't I name you? I mean, it's kind of weird, I guess, to name. Oh, I named him. I don't know why that decided to work right now, but, you know, it worked. Philip, can you even see his name from here? Oh, you totally can! That's awesome! Yay, Philip! 
Philip will help you with all your needs. Also, in my instruction book, I'm gonna be putting in here for the general store. I'm also gonna um, explain. Uh, I'm also gonna leave a YouTube video link at the end, just for people who have no idea what the heck I'm talking about, which I'm sure is gonna be a lot of people. Because let's be honest, I suck at explaining things. What if we did something like this? What would happen if I went like this? What would happen if I went like this? Should we just line this entire wall with this crap? Maybe we should. I mean, that would take care of some of the crap I need to do. Hmm. And I also need to decide if I actually want to do windows up there. I think I might. I kind of want to do like three windows up here. Maybe above the chests or something. Or something. Hello, sir. Would you like some pickles with that? Ah. You know what I really need to do? I need to go back to my videos where I like tell stories. I miss doing that. That's kind of why I wanted to do a Minecraft series to begin with. So I could tell stories. And I haven't done that yet. So sorry. What if we did signs as well? I mean, we could do that. Then we could do that. Maybe we don't have as much room as I thought for decorations. Hmm. I hear another zombie. That's not good. He's going to totally break down my wooden door. I'm surprised that hasn't been happening already, though. Is he coming in for the door? Hello? Hello? Carl? Carl? See, it's like, uh, see, it's like now i got to tear all this down. But you know what? That's okay. Where are they, zombies? There is anvils in my store now. I lied to you guys, I'm sorry, I, I totally did read the chat and reply, even though I said I wasn't going to. Where the heck are all these zombies coming from? I'm surprised I haven't invaded my face yet. Whoa, oh, there they are. What are you munchkins doing? Oh, they're trying to get to the villager from like a really weird position. Bye. Don't talk to me right now. <laughs> I can't. I just can't talk. Uh, I might have to call an episode here. Holy crap, it's already been a half hour. Um, I'm not done recording, Judah. I saw we. I, I talked to you after I record. I've been doing this weird baby voice a lot. I've, I've, that stemmed from my girlfriend always does that. She always does like a weird baby voice. Like, you know how a lot of girls, like, they do the puppy eye thing? My girlfriend does the baby voice thing. <laughs> and it gets me every time. It's just so adorable. It's so freaking adorable. I can't place that there because of the torches there. Hmm. hmm. These walls need to be covered head to toe with stuff. What else haven't I used? I need more hooks. Painting. I have a painting still. I don't know. Why does that painting keep coming up? Stop it, painting. Why is that painting keep coming up? I've got to paint so many times. Stop painting my fears. That's cool. I'll go with that. Though I don't know how my... Uh, actually, that should be fine. Okay. Um. Hmm. Where are my item frames? This might go on a little bit longer. Just because I want to finish this freaking store in this episode. Even if it costs me my life. Not really. That, that's a bit extreme, actually. <laughs> Uh, hmm. I forgot to place these down. Ta -da. There's a button there, but I need to go home. The button lights go home. Alright, it's one. Okay. So, unfortunately, now this needs to go. So just, I'm just turning out all the dec decorations I'm putting up. <laughs> I'm a silly little titty face. Um, right there, and we'll place that right there. It really sucks, I can't really place a lot in, like, these corner walls here. I feel like that I should spread these out a- well... Yeah, I probably should, really. Oh, no! Oh, great. I feel like my general store is gonna totally catch on fire one day, and it's gonna suck. What I really want, what I originally wanted to do here is place, like, a tripwire and have, like, a fence gate here you walk through so it opens and closes by itself. But, uh, I don't think I really have enough room to do that, so that kind of sucks, but oh well. Well, a pet A, um, where the heck do these paintings keep coming from? I probably broke one to place a torch, actually, never mind. 
Something be something good? Okay, that's okay. Huh. Alright. Uh, do we have anything else here? I guess I'm gonna be right back, guys. And when I'm back, I will ha have more things to place on the wall. <laughs> ah, okay. Whoa! It's done, pretty much. I accidentally placed an item frame there. Um, I might make use of that, actually. I don't know yet. Okay, so this is what I ended up with the general store. I haven't done the roof yet, but I have done all the decorating on the walls. Whoa. A lot of it's random. Of course, oh, I haven't put anything on those item frames yet. Well, crap. I tried to use up every single space on the wall that I can. Obviously, the corners are a bit tricky because you can't place an item there and then also place an item there. So minus that, I made sure every bit of the wall is covered. Uh, there's a few exceptions, but besides that, like, it's pretty filled. And I'm pretty happy with how it turned out, actually. I mean, it's really random. It looks really great. Like, for example, that isn't. But that's one of the only few places where I didn't place it. You know what? We could even place something there right now. Sure, let's place a random wooden button. I ran out of stone buttons. And I can't really, I didn't really feel like making more, um, cooked stone, so whatever. I placed windows right there as well. I thought that would look better. And it does look pretty good on the inside. On the outside, however, um, it does look a bit strange since it only goes a little bit and then it stops. But it's centered with the window here, isn't it? Come on. Oh my god, just die! Okay, it is centered with these windows, so actually I'm okay with this. Uh, there's a few things I obviously gotta do still. I gotta push this tail a bit back. Look at all these Enderman blocks. <laughs> so crazy. Unfortunately, a problem I have is zombies do come up to these doors and they do break the doors. So these doors are probably not going to last very long. Um, I have yet to write the book and place everyone's books in their chests. But minus that, I'm done with this place. I'm just going to break this crap down. Oh yeah, the other problem is is lighting. Uh, these torches have the ground here. There's a torch in this aisle, a torch in the middle, and a torch right here. Zombies, the block light level isn't good enough so I am when I put the roof I'm gonna have some hanging glowstone or something like that I'm gonna do the roof off screen though I'm gonna do like a really simple pattern so like I said it's a general store so everything's pretty simple here I'll probably do like um, smooth stone um, slabs or something because I think that would look the best and I'm probably gonna place glow hanging glowstone lamps on top actually they're not gonna be lamps they're gonna be like lights hanging down I can, I'm not gonna actually do lamps just because well those are annoying to do. <laughs> I don't know how I'd place a little something. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave likes from already. My name's Chris. Um, in between these episodes, the general store is going to be opened. And once it is open, I'll return here and show you guys how it's doing. And I'll read you the actual properly published book. But besides that, we're pretty much done here. So thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll talk to you guys later. Peace. Oh yeah, also, I'm going to change this crafting bench with an ender chest. So people can come here and be like, oh, I don't forgot to bring my money. And then they'll turn around and see the ender chest and then take the ender chest out. And then they'll be convinced to buy stuff, maybe. Yay. Bye.